Welcome back to my channel mga ka-single mind dyan. <laughs> Thank you very much for clicking this video and I know you are a bit interested to know how will you really answer the question what can you say about poverty? O anong masasabi mo tungkol sa kahirapan? So, this video will be dedicated to how do you really answer that kind of question na very general and at the same time it's a bit political and very sensitive issue well unang una mong dapat tatandaan that when you are in a pageant or when you are in a contest you are promoting goodwill and you are promoting peace kaya nga diba most pageants will always say and world peace sa dulo so you're not supposed to be for me ha uh, as a queen or as a king you should always not sabi nga dun sa movie na Thor um, a leader should not be looking for war in fact they should always be looking for peace but they must be ready just in case na their, their, their kingdom will be threatened or their country will be threatened so yun ang lagi mong tatandaan pag sumasali ka sa mga ganong klaseng mga contest lalo na kung may king and queen because a king and a queen are always ambassadors and ambassador of goodwill peace, fairness, justice and all good virtues so kailangan medyo ganun ang iyong peg so mabalik tayo dun sa tanong na anong masasabi mo sa kahirapan? what can you say about poverty? so if I will be if I will be answering that question, ang masasabi ko lang is you will always look at it half full, meaning positive. So, ano nga ba ang pwede kong isuggest na sagot sa tanong na anong masasabi mo sa kahirapan? Yun pala. Another tip that I can give you is that when your question is in, in Filipino, I think it would be proper for me, ha? it would be proper for you to answer it in Filipino as well. Huwag ka nang masyadong magmarunong, magpa-impress. Diba sabi ko nga sa inyo, that answering a question does not mean you're impressing somebody. You need to express. And if you feel that you're comfortable, considering na yung tanong ay nasa Tagalog or Filipino at that, and then sumagot ka na lang ng Tagalog. So, I may say na ganito ko sasagutin yung tanong kapag tinanong ako, anong masasabi ko sa kahirapan? Ang kahirapan ay nasa kaisipan. Dahil kung anong dinidikta ng inyong kaisipan, yon ang nararamdaman ng inyong katawan. So kahit anong hirap, kahit anong bigat, uh, kung ang inyong kaisipan ay nagsasabi sa inyo na ito ay magaan, na ito ay pinagdadaanan lamang, na ito ay isang bagay na pwede nyo pagtagumpayan, then araw-araw mo sasabihin sa sarili mo na ikaw ay hindi mahirap at ikaw ay hindi naghihirap, ikaw ay hindi nahihirapan dahil alam mo, darating ang panahon na ang kahirapan mo ay iyong mapagtatagumpayan at marami pong salamat. ba mas madali siya kasi komportable ka doon sa lingwahe na ginamit mo. But what if it was it was asked to you this way? What can you say about poverty? So, you may answer again since it was asked in English, you have to answer it in English as much as possible. But if you are in an international pageant and you feel that you will be more comfortable in answering it in in your own language then go ahead and ask for an interpreter but then again english is or will be to your advantage if you are competing in an international pageant so might as well practice answering and learning english so if you will be asking me what can i say about poverty again poverty for me is a state of mind because for as long as your mind tells you that things will pass and things will 
not be that too difficult and things will be just temporary then you will do everything you can so that every day of your life you will be looking at your life as a chance to improve and as a chance to progress then you will say that i may be poor now but sooner or later because of my perseverance and determination i will also win and become successful and i think so in that sense dun sa mga sagot in a way play safe ka kasi hindi ka dapat talaga you need not to instigate political rivalry you're not supposed to 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 create animosity because of your answer and you should not be subjective or you should not be biased and and remember that um you're an ambassador and an ambassador of goodwill so you always have to maintain your the goodwill in your answer and the good faith in your answer so so that's just my suggestion and if you say that if you say that you like it thank you very much but if you have a better answer about what can you say about poverty or anong masasabi mo sa kahirapan kung ikaw ang sasagot sa isang pageant o sa isang contest please do let me know of your answer leave it at the comment section and we'll be happy to uh, get your idea and at least you're helping other people have an idea as to what is good uh, or as to what answer will be good and approach will be good uh, for that certain kind of question so let us know what can you say about poverty anong masasabi mo sa kahirapan leave it at the comment section and i hope you like this video give it a thumbs up if you do and if you're not subscribed yet to this channel so that you can help it grow please do subscribe to this channel and once again thank you very much for uh giving us your time uh, and thank you very much for watching this video